Welcome all back to our next train. This is the forest trolley, as you can see, it is a leafy version. Let's build it together. So right after creating a train, we need to place two wheels with 12 spaces in between them. Then we can start placing two of our logs on the side. Then after that's done, we can place stairs on both sides of the wheels. And after that's done, we can fill in the rest of the middle with slabs. Then we can place stairs onto the logs at the wheels. Then we can leave one, two, three, four spaces and then place another one and do the same from the other side. And then repeat on this side too. After that we place a three high stripped oak column on top of each stairs. Then we can connect up the stairs with some fence gates. The side's the middle one. We have to leave the middle one alone. Do make sure to place fence gates at the ends of the train. After that's done, we can place a free high banner of framed glass trap doors. And then open them up. And repeat it at each of the windows. In the middle part we need to place two ladders and then on top of the ladders we need to place two doors from the inside. And on top of those two doors we need to go outside and place two more framed glass trapdoors. And then the same thing on this side. After that is done we can place the inside stairs to make it look a bit more round. And there we have a frame. Now we need to do the roof. On top of the stripped logs we can place another row of oak logs, horizontally. And then repeat on this side. Then we can place the stair facing the logs on top of the already existing stairs. And then some upward facing stripped logs. On top of these logs we can place another row of horizontal oak logs. And now we can place the roof which is made out of just frame glass trapdoors. Do the same in the middle. And then on the other side. Now that the roof is done, we can make our leaf patterns. Which I advise that you start with one side at first, put the leaves on top. Then you do at least two down. And after that's done, you can lower it as down as you want. But I advise you don't go below either the windows or the line of the train. And of course, you shouldn't do this, you shouldn't go in front of the doors. After one side is done, you just do the same thing on the other side. You start with one line, add two more on the side. And then use your creativity to go down as much as you want. After that is done, we only have the middle one left, which is actually the easiest one because we just need to fill in the grooves. And then on the middle three blocks, we just repeat the same pattern.
After that is done, we can go underneath this and place two slabs. Then we can place another one right next to this. It should be almost touching the wheels, but not quite. And then we can use that slab to drag a nice line across. And then we do the same thing on this side. Place two. Get the upper one. And then continue to lay down all of the slabs. After that is done, we can place our seats. And we just have our connection points to do. Just need to remove these two logs if you want to follow the original design. And instead of them, we need to place frame glasses and then a free high sideways glass wall. And then we just fill the top. And then we do the same thing on this side. Remove the two logs if you want to follow the original. If you don't, that's okay. And then you just finish it up like this. And this is the main cabin. If you want to make it another car, you just remove the two seats and then add the glass tables. But I have some other versions also. For example, in this train, I made a crafting card that has most crafting stations. We have an alchemy card, which is again for like the library also, that has some brewing stands and some bookshelves. We have a private card that has some walls in the middle that I added. And of course, here's the dinner card that we just made, but with some decorations. Now let's make them a locomotive. For the locomotive, I just advise you to copy over your carriage that you just made. We can just start this off by lengthening the logs. Three on the middle one and two on the side ones. Then we can lengthen our main cabin, so we need to break the frame glass. After breaking the frame glass, we need to lengthen it by one. And then we need to place double stairs, a strip lock facing forward, slab. And then after breaking the transition, we can make our front facing glass from the inside. After that, we should break this pillar bit, and we should also break the two front gates. You don't need to break the stairs though. We do need to replace this one with the stair also, and do the same thing on this side. And then replace this glass. While also destroying most of these seats, we can keep two of them. Then do the same thing on this side. And then what we can do is we can place ladders on here. Ladder on this side, and then a door from the inside on both sides. Then again, we can just go outside, and we can place our trap doors. And then the same thing on this side. Then we need to remove these two glasses so that we can place stripped oak logs and then two stairs on there so that we can make the inside wall which should be just made of frame glass. We need to destroy the top. And then we just put in the door. This most of it done. We need our brain controls and our seat. And of course, we need to destroy these leaves and then make it look nicer. But otherwise, you cannot exist. After that is done, we only have a couple of things left. We need to place a lantern right there, another one there, and another one right here. Then we can fix our glass dots, starting by placing three stairs right here. And then if you want to, you can replace these framed glass trapdoors with some stripped oaks which I highly recommend on both sides because if you do that you will be able to put another connection point right here so both of the stairs facing outside with two stairs facing the inside and then the middle being slabs and if we come back here we can see that this also needs to be destroyed and after that is done the final touch is the oak leaves which you need to hang them off of all of them except the very outer logs. And this is gonna be a build for today. My camera crashed halfway, sorry for that. I'm gonna be back tomorrow with another build, which I'm gonna be building on Twitch. So if you want to see it, follow my Twitch. And if you like the video, please, please like the video and subscribe. Check out this video and this playlist. And I will be seeing y'all tomorrow.